Welcome to Astrofacts, the series where we uncover the universe one fact at a time. For our very first episode, we're visiting the red planet, Mars. Here are 50 incredible facts about Mars and what they reveal about humanity's future beyond Earth. Mars, the red world. Mars is about half the size of Earth with a diameter of 6,779 kilometers. Yet, because it lacks oceans, its land surface is roughly the same size as all of Earth's continents combined. Olympus Mons is a colossal shield volcano on Mars, towering 22 kilometers high and spreading 600 kilometers wide. It's so massive, it would cover the entire state of Arizona. Valles Marineris, Mars's giant canyon system, is over 4,000 kilometers long and 7 kilometers deep. 10 times deeper than Earth's Grand Canyon. A Martian day, known as a Sol, lasts 24 hours and 39 minutes, so close to Earth's that future colonists could adapt with little difficulty. One Martian year is 687 Earth days, meaning settlers would wait nearly two Earth years for each birthday. The planet's signature red hue comes from iron oxide, essentially rust, covering its dusty soil. Mars has two tiny moons, Phobos and Deimos. Unlike our moon, they are irregularly shaped and likely captured asteroids from the early solar system. Phobos orbits only 6,000 kilometers above Mars's surface, so close it rises and sets twice every Martian day. No, Phobos is slowly spiraling toward Mars. In 30 to 50 million years, it will either crash into the planet or shatter into a rain system. Deimos, the smaller moon, is moving outward, drifting farther away from Mars each year, just as Earth's moon drifts from us. Atmosphere and Climate Mars's atmosphere is 95% carbon dioxide, but extremely thin, less than 1% of Earth's atmospheric pressure. Without a suit, your blood would boil from lack of pressure. Because the atmosphere is so thin, it can't block radiation or solar wind. Mars is constantly bombarded by cosmic rays that make life on the surface difficult. The Martian sky looks butterscotch orange during the day due to fine dust scattering sunlight, giving the world its eerie glow. At sunset, however, the Martian sky turns blue, the reverse of Earth. Dust scatters red light away, leaving behind cool hues at dusk. The average surface temperature on Mars is negative 60 degrees Celsius, but midday temperatures at the equator can climb just above freezing. Polar winters are brutal. Temperatures can plummet to 125 degrees Celsius, causing carbon dioxide in the air to freeze into dry ice snow. Dust devils whip across the surface, some rising taller than Mount Everest, carrying fine red particles high into the sky. Planet-wide dust storms are Mars' most dramatic feature. These storms can last for months and block sunlight across the entire planet. Mars has a 25-degree axial tilt, almost identical to Earth's, which gives it seasons. But because of its long orbit, each Martian season lasts about six months. In Mars's thin atmosphere, sound doesn't travel the same way. A human voice would sound quieter and lower pitched than on Earth water and life possibilities. Billions of years ago, Mars likely had vast oceans covering its northern hemisphere, fed by rivers and rainfall. Today, evidence of ancient rivers, deltas and lake beds is preserved in dry channels across the planet. In 2018, radar from the Mars Express orbiter detected a possible liquid water lake buried beneath the south polar ice cap. Beneath its surface, Mars still holds immense reserves of frozen water, potentially enough to cover the entire planet in an ocean if melted. Curiosity rover discovered clay minerals that formed in ancient lakes, a sign that Mars once had stable liquid water. Organic molecules had been found in Martian rocks, suggesting the chemistry of life once existed there. Methane, which on Earth often comes from microbes, has been detected in bursts on Mars though geology may also produce it. Surface conditions today are too hostile for life, 
with radiation, dryness, and thin air making survival impossible. Deep underground, microbes could still exist, shielded in caves or aquifers from radiation and cold. Martian meteorites found on Earth contain traces of organic chemistry, giving scientists clues about Mars' habitability. Exploration of Mars Since the 1960s, over 50 missions have targeted Mars. Roughly half have failed, highlighting the planet's challenges. Mariner 4 in 1965 performed the first successful flyby, sending back 21 grainy photos that changed our view of Mars forever. In 1976, Viking landers became the first to conduct life detection experiments on another planet. NASA's Spirit rover explored Mars for six years, despite being planned for just 90 days. Opportunity rover operated for nearly 15 years, setting the record for distance traveled on another world, over 45 kilometers. Curiosity rover, active since 2012, has climbed Mount Sharp, sampling rocks billions of years old. Perseverance rover is collecting rock samples today, designed to be returned to Earth in the 2030s. The Ingenuity helicopter became the first aircraft to fly on another planet, performing dozens of flights in Mars' thin air. China's Zhurong rover landed successfully in 2021, making China the second nation to operate on Mars. The Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter has mapped the surface in extreme detail since 2006, even spotting rovers from orbit. Future Colonization and Human Missions NASA aims to land humans on Mars in the 2030s, building on the Artemis program's experience on the Moon. Elon Musk's SpaceX envisions building a million-person Martian city by the end of this century, using Starship. Natural shelters like lava tubes could protect astronauts from radiation, cold, and storms. Frozen water deposits can be harvested for drinking, oxygen production, and rocket fuel. Mars's soil contains perchlorates, toxic chemicals that make growing food difficult, but they can also be processed into oxygen. Experiments on Earth have shown crops like potatoes and lettuce can grow in Mars-like soil with proper care. Mars's lower gravity, only 38% of Earth's, would allow settlers to carry heavy loads and leap three times higher than on Earth. Spacesuits on Mars must be tougher than on the Moon, flexible enough for mobility but resistant to dust, cold, and radiation. Terraforming Mars by thickening its atmosphere has been proposed, but current technology cannot release enough greenhouse gases to make it possible. If humans succeed, Mars may become the first permanent settlement beyond Earth, a true second home for our species. Mars is more than a frozen desert. It is a record of our solar system's past, a testing ground for our technology today, and perhaps the stage for humanity's next chapter. These were 50 facts about Mars and the search for life. This is Astro Facts. Join us every Tuesday for a new journey into the cosmos. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Anantum and Beyond.